There was a three gen camping skull merchant who took on the best comp team and the game lasted like nearly an hour. And they they did manage to win eventually. But they are literally known as the best comp team. And that game went on for almost an hour. So, okay. So see right here, these gens, this is nasty. There's a gen here, a gen down there and a gen here. And just to make sure nobody's on this one. Yeah. So right here is where I want to play. And on top of that, there's this one gen up here that they're actually on or so it's it's really like a four gen right see there's someone right there see the fact that they did this gen down here is not that big of a deal Ooh. just a little short So with Nurse, you generally want to blink to where you last saw them. This is a really good chance they're going to double back. See, I just got to put him here because, well, I can bring him closer to the three gen. So you want to put, you want to hook them close to your group of gens. So I got this gen. It's regressing. Somebody's here. Hello. See the double back? Right, they're gonna go unhook him. Is he giving up? He might be giving up. Ah, there you go. I don't know why he's doing that. But let me just check here. Nothing. I don't know, I guess he's lost the will to live. Might as well get another hook on him. But if he kills himself on hook, I don't want to use him on this hook. I'll put him on this hook. Because if he kills himself on hook, the hook gets taken down. You can't use it anymore. And this is a really good hook because of where it's placed. Like right here. He's probably going to kill himself. Yeah. No, they saved him. But see, there's really no reason for me to leave here. I can come up here and kick this gem. It doesn't really matter. But they were down here. You see the aura? See, one of the reasons why I would say Nowhere to Hide is the best aura perk is because it gives you an aura. I think the aura is uh, 24 meters from when you kick the gen, but the aura is not from where the gen is. The aura is from where you are. So if I kick a gen and get an aura read and then I blink. That aura is from where I'm at, right? At this point, we got one on the floor, one on the hook, one injured. Oh, that was life. See her speed boost? So that's why I didn't hit her. See how they turn? Like you blink at them and then they quickly change directions. So another thing you got to do is like flick. 
so let's say I look like I'm gonna go this way, but then I flick this way. And that was kind of a prediction blink, assuming he went in that direction. So they're probably back up on this one. I heard someone below. But like, okay, so I'll show you if I kick this gen. You see the, and I blink this way. See the aura follows me. I saw his aura. chase them on foot. Nurse is actually slower. The slowest killer on foot. Slower than all the survivors. So you really can't catch them on foot. You're forced to blink. Ghostface, Blight, Nemesis, Pinhead, Bubba, Deathslinger, Dr. Clown, and Wesker, Ghostface, Main. Ghostface is hard, man. Last time I tried to play Ghostface, I just got completely rolled. Every time I try to play Ghostface, I get destroyed. I get really good survivors that know how to loop. They just teabag me and they chain loops together. This Meg likes to go in circles. She must have watched a YouTube video that's like, when you go against the nurse, just go in circles. This guy's been laying here slug, you know what? Let's put him out of his misery. No one's gonna pick you up, buddy. We'll send you to a better place. Ghostface for the win. I wish I was better at Ghostface. I don't do well with him. I don't know. Maybe it's because... Like, I don't want to... Um, I don't really want to stalk with him because I feel like I'm wasting time and gens are getting done. But I... I think that in order to play him properly, you have to stalk people and uh, expose them. Because it's hard enough to get a single hit on them, let alone two hits in a normal chase. Okay, so you see the black around my screens, and on the right there's the little indication of uh, like Insidious. It means I'm undetectable right now. I don't have a terror radius for them. But now, the second that goes away, like now, it tells me that they're back on that gen that I kicked. So it's information, see? They're back on this gen. So as soon as I lose that undetectable status, I know that they've touched the gen. Because that's how you lose it. When they touch the gen that you kicked in order to get a uh, trail of torment. Your dads are stalking one gen, they finished it. So, with the ghost face, I like the add on the driver's license so that if you actually do expose them while they're on a gen that gen blows up i think it gets locked up by the end of d2 i'm waiting for trail of torment to come back it was on cooldown but see let's see if i get an aura read no this thing weren't close enough So once again, I'm uh, undetectable from the gen that I kicked upstairs in the main building. But now I know they're back on it because my undetectable status went away. So that's a really good thing about this perk.
it's not just for undetectable, it's for information. I don't think she's dead. Alright, now I have pop, so I can go back and kick that gen again. No, I can't kick it because it's already regressing. Oh, immediate unhook. Hello. You gonna vault it? You gonna vault it? What are you gonna do? Are you gonna vault it? No? Not gonna vault it. You want me to come to your side? Oh, the lithe. I forgot she had lithe. She was waiting for the perfect time. Nice play. I figured she might do that, but... Oh, look at that! They're down to the last gen! See? I've been just like... Messing around. Not noticing that they're... Literally cranking out all the gens right in front of Oh, in the DS? Alright. She's gotta die. DS doesn't work on nurse, sorry. Ah. Uh. Alright, well we kicked this. Here's this guy. Down he goes. The gen blows with eruption. She's up here. He might even be back on it now. Alright, so... You got DS still? I don't think you do. Get back up. What synergizes well with Nurse? have a seat. She's gonna run for the unhook. Get your endurance hit. Get your down. Just wait out his endurance from the hook. He didn't take the vault. He ran back towards them. I'm undetectable, so this is actually really good. Take the hill. Meet you on the other side, buddy. You. Oh, I can't go. I was going to take him to a special place, but the pallet's down. He'll break free before I get there. Bro sounds, bro sounds sad. The undetectable thing. Oh yeah, Trail of Torment. <coughs> I was running Pain Res earlier, and I was having a really bad time. Like, Scourge Hooks were on the edges of the map. They were nowhere near my gens, and it just got annoying. And I was like, I'm gonna change this perk. And I put uh, Trail of Torment on. Get your, your photograph, get my selfies for the scrapbook. Sweet dreams, Prince. Now where's this? Where did she go now? She could be anywhere. She might even get the hatch. Or just bleed out somewhere. I mean, I could kick a gen. Nope, I can't. Never mind. I was going to say kick the gen for the aura, but... Oh, there's a hatch right here.
No adrenaline. Well, she bleeds out in a corner then. There she is. Oh no, she doesn't bleed out. She doesn't bleed out! We get to strangle her. Sleep peacefully, Meg. So satisfying. Why is that so satisfying? It's mean. The hand on the face. Time to spend more blood points. Look, I don't know what this says. Does anybody know Spanish? Good king will play the book next. Oh, are they calling me a hacker? They said, you deceive yourself. You deceive yourself. For me, you are not pro. Uh, then they cussed me out. Uh, then they said I'm using hack. Don't suck. I already reported you. In a steam ticket so they reported me for hacking they told me I was crap I'm not pro and I deceive myself cool story You can tell them GG easy. They get so heated. Stop hacking me in my phone. <laughs> okay. Well then.